Jimmy, one of the things we haven't talked about is the growing anti-Semitism that we see in nations around the world. People have no idea of the terror that is coming on people that are Jewish in different parts of the world. Talk about this for a moment. Well, it is all around the world that this is happening, John, but more rapidly, it's taking place in what is the continent of Europe. Jewish leaders the other day said that Europe is ripe for an Islamic attack. You have to step back and look why that is the case, because so many Islamic peoples are coming to live in Europe, and they set up their own communities, and they actually live under Sharia, which is the law of the Quran. So they're setting up little miniature Islamic states. One of the reasons that the European Union does not want to allow Turkey to become a member state is they fear that would be the entrance, the doorway of bringing the Islamic world. Turkey has 80 million people, but there's 350 million Islamic peoples out there uh, in that part of the world, 1.5 billion altogether. But they would use that vehicle of Turkey, a member state of the European Union, to come into Europe. So this is prevalent throughout the world, but very much so in Europe itself with the influx and increase in the population of the Islamic people. Now this leads me then to think about what God's Word has to say about it. The Bible says in Zechariah, the ancient Jewish prophet wrote chapter 13 verse 8, during the time of trouble, and that time of trouble, Jeremiah chapter 30 verse 7, that Jacob's trouble, is going to be a time when two out of every three Jews are going to be killed. So what we see is the precursor, all this anti-Semitism that's raising its ugly head, all of this is setting the stage for these prophecies of Jeremiah, of Daniel, and uh, there in the book of Zechariah of what's going to happen among the Jewish people.